welcome back to my channel my name is diana if you're new here and if you're not new welcome back it's friday may 27th and it is the weekend so you guys know what that means weekend vlog coming your way it's almost three o'clock right now i've kind of had my usual friday situation going on gym cleaning the house <laughs> getting some work done and i'm going to go and get my brows done but the last two times that i've gone to get my brows done I went to somebody outside of my usual go-to girl and it ended absolutely terribly so today I went my usual girl was there I signed in requested her and wait waited and the girl at the front desk left and then the girl that did my eyebrows the last two times came back and she was like hi blah 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 the person that you want is going to be another 30 minutes do you really want to wait that long or do you want to just go in and i just did not have the heart to tell her that she has screwed up my eyebrows twice and i cannot deal with that anymore so i just said i had to go so i kind of cleaned them up myself i feel like they look all right they'll work but yeah it's friday we are gonna go to a new restaurant that we have never had that we've never tried before tonight so i'm very excited which is why i wanted to get my eyebrows done in the first place but it's fine we're fine today before the day ends i have a few things that i need to get done finish editing video i have a little revolve haul that i want to show you guys i'm going to palm springs next weekend and i've just been kind of trying to find like summary things and a couple of things for palm springs so i have to show you what i got I'll be honest, I'm returning the majority of it, but there are a few very good pieces. Very excited about it. I really want to read because I haven't read a fiction book in forever. I've been actually sticking to my goal of reading a couple of pages a night before bed of a non-fiction book. So far, so good, but I'm definitely craving fiction now. So I follow Caitlin Bia on uh, Instagram and she said, this book was incredible. She recommended it like none other, said it's phenomenal. So that is what I'm going to start reading today. Also, I do have to share the most beautiful flowers ever. It is officially peony season, I guess. There's just something about getting flowers and having fresh flowers in your house. Uh, I just feel like it makes the space so much more beautiful and vibrant. Anyways, I'm gonna go read. I will talk to you guys in a bit. All right, so I wanted to do a little snack reveal of a few things that I have been loving lately. First off, I don't know if I've mentioned these, but I'm obsessed with the chomsticks from Trader Joe's. These are the only ones that I get, the spicy, the jalapeno beef sticks. So good, and also a great amount of protein. I think it's like nine grams of protein for this whole stick. Not too shabby for like a little snack. Secondly, I did not buy this today. I purchased these over the last week, I think. So I've been trying all of the pretzels from Trader Joe's lately. Uh, there's a bag like this, but it's dark chocolate, not milk chocolate. That was my favorite one. I ate the whole thing. It's gone. Not a fan of the milk chocolate because it's too sweet. Not a fan of the yogurt because mm, it's not my favorite. I still think that the dark chocolate covered pretzel slims are superior to all of them. But um, Trader Joe's did not have them today, unfortunately. But that's fine. Anyways, here are the snacks that I did buy today that I really want to try out. I got these, and they're new. And then I got these with this everything and the Elote Greek style dip. Figured we could try them together, why not? So, they're like little Funyuns. Okay. Definitely oniony. I love them. Highly recommend. I get oh, I give them like a 8.5 to a 9. They're very good. Highly recommend. Probably gonna eat this whole bag tonight when we watch an, a movie. This is why it's so handy to have these. So we can just close it. Okay. Time to try this dip with this. 
This is not new, but it's new for me because I've never tried it before, obviously. They kind of remind me of Fritos. I guess that's what they're like supposed to be. Yeah. Yogurt dip. I don't know how much to put. Wow. That's very good. That was too much stuff though. Uno mas. I debated on getting chunky guac and I didn't and I kind of regret it because I feel like this would be literally a picture of guac. This would be better with guac. This is pretty good. It's just very thick. I like these more. Okay, I've been reading that book that I showed you guys a little bit ago. It's it's good, but it's more like young adult. I don't know. It's very a little bit too young for me if that's like the best way to explain it it's just i don't know it's a little too g-rated <laughs> no it's not g-rated because it's a little naughty i don't know how to explain it but i don't know if we'll continue to read it it's like i said a little too young adult for me anyways we're off to dinner let me show you my outfit blazer or you'd see a jeans. You can't see, but I'm wearing my Dolce Vita heels and I'm gonna have like a little matching bag to go with the heels. And that's it. I'll see you guys at dinner. I'll try to record everything we get as usual. Good morning and happy Saturday. It's 9.20, I have been just relaxing, drinking coffee, having a really slow morning. And Mihai and I are planning on checking out a new gym today. And I'm very excited, well, phone went into the coffee. I'm very excited to check it out. I'm really hoping that we can I'm really hoping that we can sign up to this new gym because it is super close. To, it's not like super close to our house, but it's pretty close to our house. Like it is in walking distance and I've just been really wanting to try a new gym. That's all. So that is that. I am going to make some banana bread because yesterday I got banana bread mix and I've just been craving like a good piece of chocolatey, nutty banana bread. just got done at the gym I had like a quick 45 minute workout we went to go check out this gym that was kind of like the whole point and we got a free day pass to go in there and try it out and I have not been to a gym gym like a real gym like outside of my home gym obviously and you guys have seen my home gym it's very small and there's very limited equipment but I have not been to like a real gym 
in years probably like two years so there was like a home there was like a gym that we went to for a very short period of time but it was like all outdoors during covid it was not 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 it but anyways the point is is that it was such a weird feeling to be back at a real gym and it was nice like i'll admit i actually really really liked it i like the gym because this particular gym because it's more of like a club so it's very small and they have very good equipment there's like exposed bricks so i think that's kind of cool but yeah we did end up signing up so i'm very excited to have a gym membership now and be able to go work out somewhere outside of my apartment gym so it's gonna be really nice i think the first my first time there like officially will be on monday and yeah I'm excited. I'm filming on my phone camera because I really wanted to share these news with you guys. And then another side note is that they did mention that they're installing a sauna and a cold plunge. So that will be very exciting. Anyways, we are off to go get some food and we're going to go to Costco and get some protein. Oh, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive. Okay, so first thing I got from Revolve is this tiny little white number. <laughs> I actually love this dress and I'm definitely going to keep it. I think it's probably the only thing I'm going to end up keeping. But super simple, super cute, and perfect for summer. Especially with this nice little back situation going on. Next, I have this nice little bodycon dress. It's like a burnt orange and you guys, I'm obsessed with this one because look at this open back. I'm obsessed. Okay, this is the next dress that I got and I have been like on a slip dress kick lately. I've been trying to find the best slip dresses. It looks so much better on the model. I'm definitely going to be returning it. I feel like the cleavage situation, I don't know if it's me not having enough cleavage or if it's just like kind of like, I don't know. I just don't like this situation and I also do not like this line right here. I feel like it doesn't look very nice. Returned. Okay, next up, I really wanted to love this dress. This dress is white beautiful but i have to return this dress because even nipple coverings are not they're not helping so unfortunately we are returning it and i'm really sad because i felt like this dress would have been like the perfect palm springs dress and just like the perfect summer dress we're gonna we're gonna get rid of it but also like this dress would have been perfect with these earrings like i felt like it would have been like a very nice like vacation kind of dress He said it was a, for him, it was like three. At least it was very well sorted. Constant, like, yeah. stress and anxiety, like, keeping me up. Heading to a butt spa. Miha is taking me to get a reflexology massage. So we will see how that goes. I'm gonna pull
to Trader Joe's. Mihai and I just came home from an eight mile walk. Eight, it, it, was, it was a long one. Uh, we're going to relax for the rest of the Sunday. Um, I'm going to make us dinner and some April spritz to go with it because it's such a beautiful day and I feel like April spritz is the perfect drink for today. So let me show you what I got. I got some pita bread. I'm going to make us like, oh no, um, some pita wraps. That's what I'm going to make, but they like, they ruin them. The bagger ruined them. I got these popcorn things. They're new and I'm very excited to try them. Popcorn and rice crackers. I got some bananas for some yogurt bowls for tomorrow. I'm going to put these in like a cupboard so hopefully they ripen by tomorrow. Some strawberries. Is there mold? Strawberries also for the yogurt bowls. Some mangoes. Maybe one for now. Some for yogurt bowls. Some oranges for apple spritz couple of waters because we're out of water and some tzatziki for yogurt bowls some yogurt for yogurt or for yogurt bowls did I say this for yogurt bowls this is for the pita wraps Mihai got these cheese pastries he loves cheese pastries I got some coleslaw to put into the yogurt bowls, but I'm not gonna make, it's just, I'm just gonna use the, the veggies. And then I also got my favorite dessert ever. And then some shawarma meat. These are the best. I'm just gonna pop this into the air fryer and it'll be ready in a few minutes. I feel like today was a very good and wholesome day. Um, Mihai hasn't been feeling too hot lately, so we just kind of, I don't know, like we were gonna go to yoga, but I wasn't feeling hot yoga, and I don't know, I just, sometimes you get into the mood where all you wanna do is like exercise and like take all the classes and do all the yoga, and sometimes you just wanna chill and go on a 10 mile, eight to 10 mile walk. So that's what we did today, and I'm really bummed out because tomorrow, because I signed up at my gym that I told you guys yesterday. I'm so excited about having a gym membership, but the gym's closed on tomorrow, Memorial Day, so I'm very bummed out about that, but it's fine. We're fine. But yeah, I think I just want to close this weekend off by just relaxing, having some good food, having a nice April spritz, watching TV with Mihai, cuddling, just like relaxing. We're going to watch Candy. I think that's what it's called. That's what we were watching yesterday. It's with Jessica Biel. And I love her, so yeah. It is a little bit slow, the TV show itself, but it's good so far. Honestly, I don't even remember where we left off yesterday. We both fell asleep, so. And then also, when we were walking, we ended up going to Abbott Kinney, and we had pizza, our favorite pizza, and it was so good. No regrets. I don't even care. I don't even care if Technically, I was supposed to be doing hot yoga today and ended up eating pizza. It was delicious. But yeah, anyways, cleaned up the strawberries. I'm gonna chop them up, put them in a bowl so that they're ready to go tomorrow. Even though tomorrow's technically the day, like a day off, I'm still gonna be working. Just editing, writing, doing all that good stuff. I mean, there's still a little bit, can you? Here's what I've got going on. First off, I made my Aperol spritz, and here's the thing. I put too much Aperol, so I'm going to drink a little bit more and then add the champagne to it. Because it said three ounces of Aperol. I don't know, last time I made it, I put less Aperol, more champagne, and it tasted phenomenal. But anyways, I'm ex so excited about this meal. The only thing that I kind of messed up on is I put the coleslaw sauce into the coleslaw mix. I wasn't planning on doing that because I just wanted the veggies 
but I did it, so it's kind of weird, but it's fine. So, I made some pickled onions. Hopefully they, like, marinate enough so that they, like, actually taste good um, in the wrap, but if not, it's fine. I think they'll, they'll, it'll still taste really good. I cut up some cucumbers and tomatoes like so i'm waiting for the chicken to cook we've got the tzatziki i have some leftover uh carrots that i got from the russian store so this is really cool because my dad used to own a shawarma booth and he used to add this into the shawarmas and i know this is pita different whatever pita wrap whatever but i think it's gonna taste so good so i'm very excited um and yeah that's gonna be our dinner i'm so excited Cheers to the weekend guys. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, whatever day you guys are watching this video on. As I mentioned, it is Memorial Weekend tomorrow. It's gonna be like a regular day for me probably. So that's that. But yeah, today's been an amazing, pleasant, relaxing day. My foot thing was kind of underwhelming, but it's fine. We've had a great day. Here's what we've got going on for dessert. Oranges. These are the ones that we got from Trader Joe's today. They're so good. These little wafers. And probably the rest of these cherries. 